Hey guys, so before Sun and Moon comes out, or right after at least, I wanted to open an XY Base booster box. So this I bought from the Polka Capital, which again, I always get the best stuff from there. So this is going to start the day Sun and Moon comes out. So let's do four from this side. One, two, three, four, and two, three, four from that side. And put that up in the corner. So the four arts I have from this side are Venusaur, Blastoids, Xerneas, and a Veltal. And the other side I have Venusaur, Xerneas, Blastoids, and Venusaur. So we're just going to open them in this order. So which card are you most excited about from Sun and Moon? Here's a code card, guys. Tell me what you pulled down in the comments below. Personally, I don't know. I think I got something good in the first pack. So, starting off strong, we have a Spritzy, a Ladybug, a Lillipuff, a Froki, with a Sand Doll that wanted to go with it, a Ladian, a Dodurio, a Max Revive, a Voltorb Reverse, ooh, and a Blastoids, e Mega Blastoids, which is always nice to see. Nice to start off strong. Let's get into the next pack. One, two, three. One and two. I haven't opened up much XY base, so I'm really excited to do this, to be honest. So I have a Ponyard, a Jigglypuff, a Fennekin, a Rhyhorn, a Panpour, a Corsola, a Kakuna, a Dubblade, a Froki Reverse, and a Wigglytuff, non hollow rare. So yeah, I actually didn't start recollecting until after Phantom Forces, but I did open a lot of Phantom Forces because number one, my favorite Pokemon, one of my favorite Pokemon is Gengar. So Gengar, yeah. And by the way, interesting fact, Gengar is actually the same height as me. We're both four foot 11. So we have a Weedle, a Fairy Energy, a Skitty, a Spoink, a Ponyard, a Spupa, a Great Ball, a Rainbow Energy, the Trio Reverse, and an Arbok. That was the saddest episode. If you guys aren't old enough to remember, go back and watch the episode where Team Rocket releases Arbok and Weezing because there's this hunter that's going after Coughings and Ekans. And that whole episode, it's just so sad. So I have a Bidoof, a Skitty, a Pansier, a Honedge, a Spoink, a frog, Frogadier, <laughs> Shadow Circle, almost forgot his name for a second, Diggersby, a Pansier Reverse, and a Stoutland. So, so far the only really good card I got was the Mega Blastoids, which, not complaining at all. I don't think I actually have that. I may. I don't remember. And I don't have my EX Binder anywhere near me to check, so. I have a Froakie. A Skitty. A Shelder, a Fletchling, a Swirlix, a Solrock, a Fletchner, a Crocodile, a Pikachu Reverse, and a Rhyhorn Rare. Non hollow. I can't complain too much because I know the pull rate on XY base is not as good as the other sets, but still, it's a lot of fun to open because I don't have a lot of these cards. So I have an Inkay, a Slugma, a Pan Sage, a Star You. A Swirlix, a Shauna, a Fletchlin, a Delcaddy, a Simi Seer Reverse, and a Rhyperior Hollow. Nice. I think I only have one of these right now in my collection. Last two packs, which are Blastoids, Mega Blastoids, maybe. Maybe because I pulled him, he's going to give me something good. One, two, three. Ooh, there's a little nick on that. One, two. I don't like seeing Nyx, but at least it's on a Swirlix. And then I have a Phantump, Lillipup, an Inkay, with a Ladybug who wants to go with him, a Roller Skate, a Red Card, jeez, a Delcaddy, Rhyperia Reverse, and ooh, the Xerneas Full Art. I actually already have this card, but still very nice to see another one. 
I just need the Aveltol. No, please give me the Aveltol in this box. Maybe, hopefully. One, two, three. One and two. So let's get into it. So I have a Talo, a Timber, a Pikachu, a Dark Energy, a Weedle, a Brakeson, a Evosoda, a Dunsparce, a Chespin, and a Vivion Hollow. Vivillon. Vivion. Vivillon. Vivillon. So, not bad start. I mean, a full art in the first packs? It's pretty good. And an EX. So, yeah, two hollows and two EXs. Can't complain too much. Bye, guys.